Hi friends, in this video we will talk about the three different types of bikes. Road, mountain bikes popularly known as MTBs and the hybrids. Starting off with the road bikes. Road bikes are designed for speed. They are meant to go as fast as possible on tarmac surfaces and they are popularly used for road racing. A typical road bike comes with thin tires like these. They have caliper brakes. They have a drop handlebar. This gives the rider an aerodynamic position so that he can cut through air and go as fast as possible. Road bikes have rigid forks. Their frames are designed to be light and stiff. The materials used for frames are popularly carbon, titanium, aluminum. Road bikes generally have bigger cranks in the front and smaller chain uh, cogs at the back. This gives a very high gear ratio and thus it helps the rider to go as fast as possible. Coming on to the mountain bikes. Mountain bikes are designed for rough terrains and off-road riding. A typical mountain bike comes with wide tires which are 26 inch and they have suspensions to absorb shocks, V and disc brakes to get a lot of braking power. They have a straight handlebar so as to give a better control to a rider. The frame is designed to be sturdy and strong so that it can take a lot of beating in off-road terrains. The chain wheel in the front is comparatively smaller and the cogs at the back are bigger. So unlike the road bike, it has lower gear ratios so that it can climb mountains and go through rough patches easily. The seating position is designed in such a way that the rider sits more or less upright. This gives him much control. And the wheelbase of a mountain bike is comparatively bigger as compared to a road bike. Coming to hybrid bikes, hybrid bikes are typically meant for riding in the city. A typical hybrid bike comes with 700 seat tires, which are not as wide as a mountain bike, at the same time not as uh, lean and thin as a road bike. They may or may not have a suspension depending on the usage and the preference of the rider. So this particular model comes with suspension, but they are not as tough as compared to a mountain bike. A typical hybrid bike comes with a light frame and it gives a much more upright and comfort seating position to a rider since the primary usage is going to be more in and outside the city. The gear ratios of a hybrid bike are typically not as high as a road bike. At the same time, they are not as low as a mountain bike. This gives it a perfect blend to ride inside the city. Thank you for your time.